Hello, this is Ishma Sadi. Welcome to my Java tutorial. Today I'm going to talk about border layout. Um, let me go ahead and Photoshop real quick. So, border layout is obviously the layout, it controls the layout of the the J frame. So, the J frame is the window. Let me just demonstrate here. So, this is the J frame. So, the border layout um, has five properties. It has north, east, south, center, west. So when you want to assign a component, i.e. button, J label, J text field, you assign it to one of these um, east, south, center, west. And some may think, oh, so I'm only limited to five components. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you otherwise. Okay, sound like a teacher there. <laughs> okay, so we want to import um, the border border layout. A W T dot border layout. Cool. Okay, so uh, um, if I'll, I'll recommend you pause and type all this down, especially the main. Um, you can say this. basically I set the main body as an object. Set the size. And when we close the X, it closes. Although on Eclipse, when we do hit the X, it does close. But that's very useful for you know other compilers. We don't want it to be resizable, and we want to set it to true, so we can actually see the J frame. Okay, so um, and here we set up a constructor. So I'm going to add five properties. Um, I'm going to add three buttons and uh, two J labels. So J button B1 new J button and whatever you put between the parameters is going to rename the button so I'm going to call it OK semicolon and we're going to copy and paste because uh, you know what the <laughs> OK um, two we can change this to I love cheese and J button. Ah, oh, let's copy and paste. Too lazy. Three. I hate. Ah, uh, oh, can't hate anything. <laughs> okay, so J lay bowl L1. You can rename them anything you want. New J label. Um. This is Ishmael Zadi. So cool. Um, copy and paste that. Change that to two. I love Java. Okay. And now we want to declare the border layout. Border layout. There's other techniques to doing it, but I want to make it short so I don't have to keep typing the border layout when I'm declaring it or assigning it so uh, new border layout and finally we declare the J frame I should declare that first but not problem F new J frame okay so we're good to go and I'm just gonna add a comment here objects properties properties okay uh, I want to set the the window title so super set title Ishmael the D application you can name it anything you want and now we want to set F the frame to border layout set F set layout where are you okay here you are B whatever you named your border layout okay so we want to add all these buttons so add we want because in Java you need to add all these components to the J frame so add B1 comma um, B I'm gonna set this to north I want OK to be a north. So north 
I'm just going to copy and paste. Okay, so B2, set this to center, and this to south. South, South London, I'm from South London. <laughs> now we get tracked. Okay, so, no, this is meant to be 3. L1, we want to set that to west. Um, L two we want it what did we didn't use east we didn't use east so east okay so uh, we run the program and ta-da look at that so I love cheese that's a button and maybe I should make a program which views all the type of cheeses through an array list that'd be awesome um, okay, so yeah, so um, you probably think this is useless. Yeah, that's the other trick you do on Eclipse. You just wiggle it around. Anyways, back to the compiler. We want to view everything. Let me go back to Photoshop. There's something called J, J panel. Okay, and J panel can be stored anywhere in the frame so um, if we want to set a J panel J panel is basically like a J frame but not exactly a J frame it's like so yeah we can set all the properties all these five properties into a J panel and assign this J panel um, to south east did I just say east I mean west <laughs> uh, sorry I'm a bit dyslexic so yeah um, okay so uh, we want to do that I'm talking too much. So go here, objects J panel P equals new J panel. Panel. Okay. Alright, so uh, we want to change this. We don't want the frame to be set to B, so we want to set P and we add P to all of them. So we want them we want them to be added to to the panel okay so okay so finally we add the panel add P and we can say anywhere let's set it to let's say south all of south okay now we run it it's gonna be a useful thing hopefully see there is it there's magic. So that's the great uses for border layout. Oh, I hate Eclipse when it does that. And yeah, so let's go back to this application. So um, I didn't really add any properties, you know, set the text to certain fonts and, uh, you know, add a bit of, you know, gooey interactive stuff. But in the next tutorial, um, please save this as, um, you know, in your project and we'll be hopefully expanding. And yeah, I hope you learned from this tutorial and I'll see you next time and see ya.